Hey folks, welcome back to the shop. Uh, it's kind of a build. I'm going to kind of do a build for you. It's something a little bit different. Uh, my wife paints, um, not like houses or walls. It, heavens no, she can't do that. But she can take a paintbrush and she can paint a picture. And she's really good at it. And she had me make some things um, for her. I can get, this is what they are. This is a template for them. Uh, basically, you can fit a canvas in here. You get two of them. You can put a thin canvas in here. Um, well, it's the night before Thanksgiving is what it is. And uh, part of the Thanksgiving dinner that my uh, church puts on uh, is a craft area for the kids. And uh, so they have elected her to have the kids paint. So I need to crank off four sets of these like now, like yesterday or the day before. But it's going to be tonight. Uh, this is kind of cool if you have an artist in your life. Um, it's, it sits on the tabletop. It's a tabletop easel, so to speak. Um, they're real easy. Everything can be done at the bandsaw. You could probably do it with a jigsaw. My hand's not steady enough for that. Um, and I can give you the measurements. Uh, I don't know how to tell you to get this. I do know how to tell you to get this. I just started an email for this channel, and I'll link it in the description of this video. It is Pastor Fred's Shop at Yahoo.com. Okay, so if you email me or if you comment, hey, I would like an outline of that template, I'll draw this out on a piece of paper. I'm not, I don't do digital stuff. I'll draw this out on a piece of paper and I'll send it to you and you can just cut it out. Uh, what I'm using to make this is, how about these two pieces of junk? Uh, oh, that's got pocket holes in it. Maybe that won't matter. It will matter. I can get one here. All right, I'll get these drawn out and then we'll figure it out, and then we'll head over to the bandsaw. All right, so here's the dealio. <clears throat> you can see the pocket holes. I can just about miss that one. So I'm just going to go ahead and trace that out and say that that's going to be good. I can't believe the pencil didn't break. I believe this used to be part of a palette. You can make this out of anything. Anything at all. Boom. There we go. All right. Now, she told me that she only needs a little slot, but if I'm going to make them, I might as well make them. Okay. So, now, how can I avoid these? Um... Do you think I'm making this more difficult than it needs to be? I do. Let's just do this. There. Okay, here we go. So here's my question, being that it is the night before Thanksgiving. Do you people cook dinner on the night before Thanksgiving? Or do you order out? We were just discussing that as we were eating the pizza that we ordered out uh, from the wrong town. We ordered it from the next town out, so it took an hour and a half to get here. Don't make that mistake. Um, but I'm curious. Do you cook on the night before Thanksgiving, or do you order out and get pizza or something like that? Let me know. I'd be interested to know. Okay. All right, I'm going to finish drawing these out. I have another piece of wood here that's got 70 pocket holes in it. This thing looks like it got ran over by a forklift. But I'll get these drawn out, and the next thing you'll see is we'll be at the, we'll be at the saw. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and apologize in advance. <clears throat> my bandsaw, <clears throat> excuse me, I changed the blade on my bandsaw, and it's really loud now. Uh, I can't see that at all. Uh, still can't see it. And my dust collection isn't set up, so I got to run the shop back. 
I apologize. And I'm not going to have enough room to cut this. I don't think. I don't know. We'll try it and see. All right. Here comes the noise. Up. Oh. No noise. Is it plugged in? Nope. Oh, well, there's the plug right there. Okay. Bear with me. Okay. All right. Here we go. I'm serious this time. Okay, it's going great, except for the fact that I cannot see a thing. Cannot see what I'm cutting. And that, my friends, just ain't good. Here, what if we took this? We're improvising now. What you can't see is there's a little lamp behind the saw. So if we can lift that up a little bit. How's that? Oh, look at that. Is that what I'm cutting? Sure. Perfect. All right. Here we go. Okay, so there's one. And as you can see, the way my bandsaw is set up, I don't have enough room to put this whole piece in and cut this part without this side hitting the saw. So I need to explain to my wife that I need a thousand dollar bandsaw and see if she goes for it. I doubt it, seriously. So from this point, can you see how nasty that cut is? Holy mackinole. That's all right, because we have to sand this. There's gonna be little kids using these and uh, this is rough cut. So I need to sand these really well. Which is the great thing about this, as long as your bottom is flat so that it sits, it's kind of hard to mess up. So, gee, I guess I have to set my sander up now. It hasn't been plugged in in six months. Okay, that'll be fun. All right, folks, I don't know if this is a tip or not. This is just something I noticed. Um, if you, It's the classic rigid sander. But that's where my lock is for 40 or for straight flat whatever so i'm going to put that on it because it's got a little bit of extra kick to it see that's got a lip in it all right so it's right just double check is all i'm saying look how dark that is there I wonder if i can get my light over here now nah, we'll be fine all right oh dust collection can't wait to get that hooked up all right so now it's just a matter of flattening, getting all the bandsaw marks out, getting that, you know, shark's tooth out and making sure this is nice and smooth so nobody gets hurt. Because that's not what tomorrow's about. Folks, I'm telling you, it is 8.30 the night before Thanksgiving and it's 37 degrees out. Moses. I'm in shorts, by the way. <laughs> Okay, so that's what is that line to? Nope, that's not me. That's one. I've got one, two, three, four, five more to do. I am going to run over this with the random orbit sander and with the get a little bit nicer looking. I don't put any kind of finish on these because they're going to get painted anyway. I mean, that's what they're for is just you know to hold up the the canvas while someone's painting. So I'm going to crank these off real quick. Again. If you're interested, let me know. I'll draw out the template 
on a piece of paper and you can cut it out. This is um, MDF, Mass Dumb Board, N M D F, Mass Density Fiber. It's cardboard. Anyway, so you can take the template and put it on a piece of that and cut it out and then you'll have it forever. Um, I'm going to go ahead and sand this up. And uh, maybe tomorrow I'll take a couple pictures of the kids painting. But in the meantime, again, have a great Thanksgiving. I got to get these things cut out um, and done in a hurry. So have a great Thanksgiving, folks. Don't eat too much turkey. Bob, I'm looking at you. Don't eat too much turkey. It'll make you sleep and you'll miss the football game. Is there football? I don't know. Um, who cares? Enjoy your family because that's what it's really about. If you're fortunate enough to have family come in, enjoy time with your family. In the meantime, God bless. I'll see you on the next one.